Good morning, everybody, and welcome back to the lounge where not just one, not just two, but we all are here for each other. Welcome back. Glad to be here. Good morning. It is an early fucking morning, man. Uh, I slept, but you know, it's, it's one of them nights you just don't sleep worth a fuck. But uh, I wanted to talk about a couple things. About something that I think that you're going to find to be inspirational to those of you out there that are still that are still uh, fighting the fight, that are still trying to to find that that silver lining on your path. And trust me, I understand. I know what it's like to be alone. I know what it's like to be without. I know what it's like to feel like no one wants you. I know what it's like to feel like everyone's against you. I know what it's like to feel like everything you do, there's a wall that drops in front of you. And that's another reason that I did this channel. That's another reason that I do what I do. Okay? For those of you out there that are going through recovery, that maybe you're you're on a, you know, uh, you, you've got something set up for yourself, you're you're either you quit cold turkey and you're trying to fight that fight alone. Or some of you might be on Suboxone. Or some of you might be on the opiate, uh, I forget what they call it. And some might say, well, how do you know, John? What do you know what it's like? I'm going to tell you. Have I ever done meth? Never. Have I ever done other like small drugs, I'm sure I have. But have I, ever, have I ever had an addiction problem? Of course I did, a long time ago. Being addicted is, 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 you know, it doesn't matter if it's pills you're addicted to, or if it's meth, or if it's alcohol, or if it's marijuana, which if you're addicted to marijuana, I'm just gonna tell you keep on smoking, you feel me? <laughs> keep on smoking, because there ain't nothing wrong with it. Marijuana won't kill you. It only get people to judge you to make you uh, to think that you're a bad person because you smoke it. But you know, and 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 for my profession, you know, for uh, you know, I, I can't sit there and tell probationers and not nah, you know you go out and smoke all you want because there's protocol protocol that I got to follow, but. I want to talk to you guys about a couple things. Things just made me even change my mind about some stuff or, or think more about exactly what I'm doing. And I'm still on the right path no matter what I do, no matter what way I go. But I'll get into that in a little bit. Right now, I want to talk about you. And I want to talk about as you're struggling. All right. And I want you guys to do me a favor. There's a link down below. Right down below this ugly face right here. There's a link down there that goes to Josh Vape. I want you guys to go give him a subscribe if you've not subscribed to his channel. Guys, go give him some love. This guy is a good dude. I, I feel like it's one of them dudes that I would hang out with. You know what I mean? And, that, and that's really, honestly, the way it is with, with all you guys. I feel like you guys are people that, that I would sit around with right here. You know what I mean? But, um... Go, go subscribe to Josh. I, I like, I like the dude. I like his, his outlook on life. And uh, Josh, I was watching your video when you was walking the trail. <laughs> yeah, you're like me, brother. You might want to throw out them cigarettes for a while. I'm actually thinking about going to the vape, honestly. So, if anybody would like to start with me, okay, I don't got the money right now. Unless somebody wants to start, unless y'all want to throw some donations down there. There is a link. <laughs> I'll go get me one today if anybody wants to start it up with me. But uh, I'm a poor ass, so I can't do nothing. Anyways, uh, I'm thinking about going to the vape and starting that. So if y'all want to want to start that with me, if you want to lay down the cigarettes and vape with me and ride it out with me and let's throw away these cigarettes and let's do the vape, let's do that cigarette instead of the, you know what I mean? I mean... You know, they say, well, the vape ain't good. Neither was well, not. It's got, it's got stuff in it, too. Y'all see that? I'm telling you, we got a ghost up in this house. And 
now it ain't going to move. There it went. See it? You guys, there is no breeze in this house. Okay, I'm not gonna pay attention to that shit. All right, <laughs> you fucking freaked me out. All right, here I'm. If you don't mind, whoever you are, I'm just gonna shut the door for you. Go to bed. Anyways, um, the, the vape, you know, the vape's better than than a cigarette because you're not putting all that smoke in your lungs. And I'm out of shape too, man. I remember when I used to be able to run a mile, guys. I used to be able to run a mile when I was still in school a long time ago. I could run a mile in 503. Uh, I used to be in really good shape when I was when I was uh, in self-defense classes, going through, you know, got my first degree black belt and did all this stuff. I was I was in some I was in good shape good shape you know what I mean but oh well I mean it is what it is anyways let me get off the, the topic here what I wanted to talk about um, look if you're having a tough time and again remember if y'all want let me finish that first shit uh, if you want to start the vape thing with me uh, let me know and uh, as soon as I can get it we'll start together I don't want you to start a day before me or a day after me. We'll, we'll do it together. Uh, right now, I can't afford to get it. But maybe in a few weeks or something, I can. So if anybody wants to start that up with me, let me know. Uh, maybe you, Josh, start up the vape, man. Um, you know, I, you know, it's, it's something I think would be fun to, to challenge ourselves to, to see if we can to ride it out. Um, so yeah, think about that. And you guys go there and subscribe to Josh. That link's down there as well. It's right above the link for the PayPal for anybody that wants to throw a donation my way. Considering I don't have Super Chat or none of that stuff. And uh, yeah, oh, and, and let me get let me get a message out real quick to a hater that, that sent me a message uh, about money. Listen, I'm not about the money. All right, I've said it before. And I, I never said that anybody would throw me money. Never said, them words never came out of my mouth. Not once. If they wanted to, sure. But you know what? If they don't, they don't. It's not a big deal. That's not why I'm here talking. But the option's there. And you know what? One of these days, those of you that sit there and, and criticize that uh, this channel will never generate this or that. When it does, I'm going to be throwing you double deuces, bitch. Simple as that. All right? Anyways, guys. Uh, on to the fight. Fighting the fight. Okay? Listen, I, I know that it can get rough. But you got to think positive. And you got to think of your, your position right now where it's not in your system at all. Think clearly, all right? Think clearly and think about the things that you can have in your life without that. And think about what it's gonna be if you if you fall out and go and do it again. You're gonna be, you're gonna be taking steps backwards and starting all over again. It, it, it's only for a certain amount of time that your body and your mind gets that huge crave of wanting it. And then it'll go away. Then it'll come back. And those that's done it, you'll know I'm right. Uh, and, and when you got that, instantly find yourself, do something to, to distract it. Think of something that really keeps your mind positive. Go do something. Go for a walk. Maybe, you know, I, I don't know. Find a hobby. Do something. It will help you. It will. Even if it's picking up your phone and making a phone call to one of your friends and just having a conversation to where that's not on your mind. Just 
block it out, all right? And the next best thing is when you see this lounge open, when you see the sign on our door that says open, welcome all, come in the lounge, hang out, chat. If there's something going through your mind or you're having a hard time, you come on in, you stand up and you talk. You know, I see the lounge as being not just a YouTube channel, you guys. I see it as being a, a huge support group for one and another. I see it being support for those that's trying to fight the fight to not go back on drugs, those that's, that's going through problems with relationships, those that's just going through problems with self-esteem, those that's going through problems of being bullied, those, you know, and, and that's another big thing. I'm going to be talking about that later. It's cyberbullying. Another big thing. Matter of fact, I'm doing a speech on it. And I'm going to record it when I do my speech in front of a whole bunch of people. Anyways, uh, we're a family, man. We're a family. And I know that, uh, that you know, from time to time, that we're going to get those people that come in and we're going to think that they're, they're good people. I know that. And the next thing we know, they're going to be, you know, tricking us and we're going to be seeing the reality that, oh, man, they, they fooled us. Uh, but it's, it's, it's good. It's good. Um, yeah, we got to be here for one another guys, because that's all we got. That's what we got to get by. That's why the lounge is up and running. It's up and running to help each other get by, to help us get through. To help us fight that fight. I love every single one of you. I don't got to see your face to love you. I don't got to shake your hand to love you. I don't got to have a hug to know that you love me. I mean, it, it's nice to feel someone put their arms around you and tell you that they love you. But it's also nice to know that where you're sitting, when you're in the lounge, no matter where you're at, no matter if you're in the front, or if you're in the back, or if you're in one of the corners, it doesn't matter because everybody is equal. And my friends, that is what it's about. That is what it's about. Above and beyond the haters, the ones that want to hurt, the ones that want to judge, the ones that want to say, "Oh, I'm, I'm going to do this. I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm going to tell people you're this, or I'm going to make up these fake names, or whatever." Do what you do, bro. Because we're going to do what we do. And we got the support behind each other. And that's what it takes, man. People are all the same. We all breathe the same air. Okay? We all walk on the same earth. We all shut our eyes to go to sleep. And we all open our eyes the next day the very same way. That's why I call it hypocrites that want to pretend to be better. Because nobody's better than the man next door. And all this crazy drama that's been going on, we're squashing it, y'all. We're going to squash it. For now on, mods, when people come in to do that, just take care of the problem and don't even mention it. And let us move on with our conversations, having a good time. Now, I'm not saying if something bad's going on, not to tell me. But I am saying, when we're in the lounge, let's do what it's for. Let's help each other. For those of you that's struggling right now, if there's anything I can do, maybe you, maybe you need some advice. You can ask me and here's the beauty of it. When someone asks me about advice on something, I'll come back, I'll speak it without saying names, I'll, I'll talk about it as in the third person. 
That way nobody knows who the, which one's going through that problem. And the only way you're going to be able to trust me on, con on, on something like that is by taking a chance. I guarantee you won't regret it. You'll realize that I'm probably the most honest person that you'll ever come across when it comes to YouTube and stuff. You know, we've all, everybody's got a past. We all live, and we live to make mistakes, and we live to learn, and we also live to get through it. And that's what we're here for. Locking thumbs together, people. Lock them thumbs, shake them hands, and let us stick together. I hope everybody has a good day. Blue Wings, I'm not sure. I've not talked to her since 1 o'clock yesterday. I'm a little bit worried about her. So, Blue Wings, if you see this, get in touch. I'm worried about you. All right? Hope everything's going okay. It's just when I when I hear about something like that, it just makes me wonder, man. I hope hope no one's got to her and said something horrible, making her feel over there, you know, making, not her, but anybody at that, making this person feel bad because whatever, but... I don't think that's the case with, with Blue Wings, but I'm, I'm just saying in general. You always you always kind of wonder that in the back of your head. Man, are they okay? You know? Y'all just see that? I'm telling you, bro. That door is back open. That ain't no bullshit. Oh, yeah. Shit. Anyways, like, share, subscribe, and guys, let's show these people. The lounge is going up and up and up. We're going to hit that thousand, then we're going to hit that two. And that three, and that four, and that five. Because there's a lot of people in the world that's looking for support. There's a lot of people in the world looking to build their confidence. And when they realize that there's a place they can go to, just like you, they're going to be here too. We're going to have to expand. We're going to have to get out the construction signs and put it outside the lounge. Making sure people be uh, watching their step when they come in. Shit. All right, guys. Like, share, subscribe. I love you all so much, man. Every one of you. Josh, keep up the good work, brother. Thank you so much for doing doing all that good talk that you do. I love you all so much, man. Every one of you. And I'm here for you. And that's the way it is. <laughs>